everyone. Welcome to Maker Monday. This Monday I have hopefully a very easy and fun project for us called Blobs in a Bottle. For this particular project, you are going to need a one liter bottle that is empty. I have a water bottle here, but a soda bottle or whatever will be just fine. You will need three quarters of a cup of water, some vegetable oil, a funnel, and some red food coloring. You can use other colors, but red is better. And then something to create fizz. So I have here um, some expired airborne tablets, which I'm going to use because, you know, they're expired. But something like Alka-Seltzer will work just fine. Okay, these are our things we're going to first, we're going to remove this label from the bottle. Um, and then I'm going to use my funnel to pour water into the bottle. Okay, then once you do that, you fill up the bottle with vegetable oil almost to the top. Now this is, uses a lot of vegetable oil, but oh my God, and I totally poured it too fast. So it, all right, learn from me here that I poured too fast. And so the vegetable oil overflowed from the funnel. So you have to take it slow. All right, we're gonna take it really slow because now I have it all over <laughs> the floor and my legs and everything, which is fine. I'll clean it up later and this is how we learn, right? Okay, um, I'm going to add more vegetable oil. <laughs> and yeah, it's interesting how it takes it a little bit, uh, how it drains through the uh, funnel very differently than water. And we're gonna see some more of the differences between oil and water here in a little bit when we've got this all done. Okay. All right, I think that's good. We've got it almost full. I'm gonna say that's good and then I'm going to let it sit for a minute. I want to put the top on just in case, knowing my look, this thing would fall over and spill everywhere. And that's actually happened to me before I started filming was I spilled the the um, first three quarter cup of water that I had. So I had to pour another one, um, hence this towel that I've got right here. So right here, we're kind of observing um, how the water and the oil are separating. So the reason why these separate is because they have different molecules in them. So the oil molecules are lighter than the water molecules. Um, and so that's why the oil is sitting on top of the water. And I think that's pretty cool. So we're gonna go like this. Just This is just for fun. We're gonna mix this up. And you see how cool that looks with all the bubbles? Yeah. So we'll give that a little bit of time to settle. You definitely don't have to do that in your experiment. I just thought it would be fun. We're gonna give that some time to settle and then we will move to the next steps. Okay, so now we're ready for the fun stuff. My oil and water are separated yet again. So now we are going to take this opportunity to add about 10 drops of food coloring. Um, I have chosen red, but you can pick another color if you like, just something that'll show up pretty well. So I'm going to put 10 in here. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. There we go. So we've got them, they're all at the bottom and now we're going to add a half of tablet of this 
airborne. I wonder if, yeah, there we go. I'm gonna see what this does. Okay, so I'm not getting quite as much of the effect I'd like, so I'm gonna add the other half of the tablet and see if that will make a difference. Okay, so we have fizz, but it's not bringing up the color like I thought it would, and I wonder why that is. I mean, well, it is actually. Yeah, now, now it is. Now I see how it's, but do you see how this is happening? We've got all these little blobs. Yeah, that is super cool. Do you know what this reminds me of? It reminds me of a lava lamp. Have you ever seen one of those? They're like these, they're these cool lamps and they have all the, well, they're just like this. And um, I really wanted one when I was a kid and I never got one. So now I've made my own, I guess. Now I just have to figure out how to light this up. Isn't this cool? Look, that is so neat. And so the cool thing about this, um, this project is even though you are using quite a bit of vegetable oil, this is a, a project. It's not like a one and done project. What you can do is you can put the lid on your little blobs in a bottle here, your little or lava lamp, whatever you want to call it. You can put the lid on it. And then anytime you want to see, you know, once they've, they've all died out, anytime you want to see your um, blobs come back to life, you can just add another tablet. So yeah, I think that's super cool. And it's interesting how it took, it took a while for it to get going, but now it's like, it's like this really cool little thing that I feel like I could stare at for hours and hours and hours. So there we go. That's what we've got for our Maker Monday for you. Nice little blobs in a bottle slash lava lamp. Thank you so much for tuning in to this little project here. Until next time, okay? Bye.